what are more specific ways that we can use AI now um, with a higher return, right? One of those examples I, I believe in is, is in testing. As software engineers, uh, software engineers write a lot of tests for their code. I touched on this earlier, but you know, we think mm -hmm. about different levels. Unit tests, which is very specific focused tests. Um, then we get into integration tests, which test multiple components together and ultimately end-to-end -end tests, which test the whole system. Um, but those unit tests, you know, they're very tedious. Uh, if you talk to uh, software engineers, you, you'll often hear this, that the least favorite part of their job is the time spent writing unit tests, right? I think this is a great application to start using AI um, to save time and ultimately make developers more productive. So I think there are, you know, initial wins that we can see and, and places we can start to build this out. But the idea that we are going to vibe code enterprise applications or we're going to replace software engineers with AI is just not a reality today that, that we see from our actual real clients.